Hi everyone, welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu in the crew. I'm Rebecca. Today's Friday, so it's time for our weekly video showing what's new for the week at the Dollar Tree. I went to four stores this week in Northeast Texas, and the address will be listed in the description box below. And this is for the week of May 20th, 2022. I apologize, my voice is a little hoarse. It's just due to allergies. So here's a sneak peek of a few pictures from last Saturday. It was my daughter's wedding. My oldest daughter got married and we had all seven of our daughters in the wedding, as well as our two sons and two nieces and one of my nephews. It was a beautiful, gorgeous day in Texas for a wedding. This is right before we lined up, just getting ready to go. And this picture is from shortly after the ceremony. I'll have a lot more pictures for you guys in a few weeks. I just wanted to show you a few. So I was so excited. I couldn't wait to show you guys. So let's go shopping. So let's go over to Apparel and Accessories first this week. They had a whole bunch of their sandals for adult sizes all the way down to children's sizes and a bunch of new bags. These are the extra large shopping bags. They're kind of like the plastic feel that you can wipe off. They had summer print, the nautical theme, and like different trucks and things. They also had the smaller size shopping bags, which are the earth friendly bags and the bright colors like orange, yellow, and blue. And those, of course, are like the no tear bags that you can use over and over again. Then they had a bunch of their canvas bags in this week with the screen print pictures on the front of them. The first three that I'm showing you are repeat styles, but then these ones here are new with the truck, the bicycle, um, and the gnome. So I love this truck. It's in a purple color ink. It's really pretty. It says spread kindness. And then they had their gnome, which is so cute in the blue. It says bloom and grow with the flowers all around. And then you could also get this purple one that says it's all about the journey with the bike and the butterfly. And they had the plain one that you could decorate yourself. So this week's bargain find is their t-shirts that a bunch of Gildan and Brand fitted long sleeve t-shirts with the contour fit and they had them in a ton of different colors i picked out a few we used we actually purchased the purple the coral and red but then they also had some long sleeve shirts in the anvil brand and this was a hoodie style shirt with a drawstring at the neck and it was a thin uh, material it was a really nice shirt also they had some more of their bucket hats in this week the solid colors like pink black and blue which we saw these last week, but they also have a bunch of printed ones. I showed a few last week. This week they had the pink and blue tie dye uh, kind of style. And then of course they had the boho rainbows, which we saw last week, as well as the stripes. And then the camouflage sharks. This week I found it with the lemons on it. And then the different hibiscus and large palm leaves. They also had their infinity scarves. So they had the solid black with like white polka dots, the green and white floral. And then this one here matches the bee like cups and plates they had out a few weeks ago. Um, this scarf here, it's the exact same print. And then they've got the, it looks almost like a Dalmatian print, the blue geometric pattern or the bright purple yellow and pink flowers. They had some Kiwi brand um, shoelaces and the Americana theme also. Over in Arts and Crafts this week, they had this new lace crochet um, like border or trim in two different colors. They had the off white and white. And then you could also get the Crafter Square macrame thread and you get it in these little skeins. Uh, they just had it in this color. Again, you could get the mini macrame wall decor kit. It's everything you need in it to make the craft and the rainbow kit. They had some new flowers out this week, like these small uh, flowers here with the little um, like floral shoots that come out from the sides or the ones with the little white flowers and greenery attached. Some more of the larger um, blossoms and ferns and then they had some of the smaller kind of like farmhouse style uh, wild ferns and different kind of like wildflowers this week they looked a lot more realistic than some of the flowers they get in throughout the year so I was really happy to see those some of my favorites this week were these farmhouse 
floral pick. So it's got this really pretty sage green with an off-white flower. And it's got these little like wildflowers kind of tied in with them and some curly cute little stems. So cute. I love the sage green and the off-white. And then they also had them with the larger flowers that were in the sage green with the white. Then you could get the same style flower in this really pretty pink. They had it in a country blue also. Some DIY wood pieces. They had a crown, a rainbow, and then the large paw print. And those are all the large crafter square DIY wood pieces. The large circles are about the size of a pizza pan. And then they also have some more of their wood rings. You could either get the five or six count pack, depending on which package you purchase. Also the stacking boxes here, three different sizes. They're all the same price, however, despite the difference in sizes. And then they had a whole bunch of the Crafter Square fabric. So this box had a bunch of patterns in it like rainbows, um, controllers for like an Xbox or PlayStation. They also had the red background with the lightning bolts, some black, white, and gray camouflage. And then the pink background with some different um, sayings and like lipsticks kind of geared towards tweens. They also had a bunch of country farmhouse style looking fabric or different prints with like butterflies, flowers, the blue trucks with the white background. This one here is a blue background with some coral and teal flowers. They also had some bicycles with the white background and they're holding baskets of sunflowers. There's also the blue truck with the daisies in the back that has a dark blue background, the buffalo plaid, white and black rolls. They had some more sunflowers. I just love this one with the home. It says gather. It has the watering cans with some eucalyptus leaves. Also the tie dye um, fabric. You can get them in all the different colors of the rainbow. Some more of the farmhouse style. So a lot of these are like stripes, plaid, um, a bunch of different kind of like muted tones, a lot of country kind of colors you would um, think of. And they had a few that were a little bit more bright with like some pink undertones and purple. But a lot of them were just like brown, blue, gray, and like a darker green color. So we'll just scroll through, through all these Crafters Square fabric boxes. The one store I went to had like eight boxes of this fabric sitting out. The other store had four. And then one of the stores I went to this week only had two. So it just depends on which store you go to. Um, you know, it depends on what fabric they have out this week, but they did have quite a bit. And since each store seemed to have more than they usually do, I think they're getting a lot in um, as of late. So these are all the printed patterns. Then they also had a box full of just the black and white solid colors, or you could get the rainbow solid colors also. Then they had these large metal words that say family and the silver, thankful and welcome. And then to add just a new twist to it, they also have them in the black metal. Again, they have the family thankful and welcome, or you could get it in the rose gold. The rose gold has almost like um, a mottled look to it where it looks like it has some dents in it um, just to kind of give it a little bit more of that country look. And they had those also in crosses. So you could get the silver cross, the black, or the rose gold. These rub on transfers. I found them at a few more stores this week. I just finished a few crafts this week that I'll be sharing with you guys either this weekend or sometime this week. I still have family here for the wedding, so I'm a little bit behind in doing the crafting video edits. They also had a bunch more of these um, stained wood beads. They also have them in the natural wood, and I found those at a few more stores this week. So now over in the health and beauty, we'll start with the cosmetics this week. There's not a whole lot new, but they did have more of these um, Ioni brand 3D mink lashes. These are the very full kind of dramatic wispy lashes you do have to buy the glue and then they had a bunch of sally hansen nail polish they had the full size bottles which are the half fluid ounce 
And then they had those in a bunch of different colors, like almost like a mustard green or yellow. They had dark blue, a really pretty gunmetal kind of silver color. And then they had a bunch of the nail art. Um, I believe it has like a striper brush that you can use. And they had a whole bunch of different colors of those. And those also are the Sally Henson brand. Then they had the LA Colors nail art, which was the Create Shimmer Nails. It comes with this little um container of really fine glitter that you can use with the nail color and all of the nail colors coordinate with the glitter that comes in the package with it and they were in like a plastic box sitting on the shelf like one of those little pop-up containers with the pieces in it that help hold the cards up over in hair care this week they had some new headbands for little kids these are the really small ones for itty bitty children's so they had them and it's really pretty pink and light purple with the flower on the side and then they had the um, barrette clips with the off-white and gold polka dot flower you could also get the dark pink or light pink with the gold polka dots they had matching coordinating um bows and you can get those in all three colors the dark pink light pink or off white and then you can get them in a headband as well they had some new barrettes this week these really pretty um daisies and there's just the back of the barrette here so you guys could see what that looks like you get one barrette on each card and those are the cards with the white background you could also get the stars then they had these fashion headbands that had the knots all the way down around the outside and they had a whole bunch of different like tie-dye patterns to them so some had more of like purple and blue and like a magenta pink color and then others had more of like an orange pink yellow and white color scheme so there were a lot of those some new claw clips i thought these were really pretty these are the two-tone clips those are the blue background scunchy brand uh, clips and then they also had the dent free uh, clips also these new scrunchies which i just fell in love with i actually purchased two of these for my one daughter's birthday that's coming up they had them in the natural color this really pretty mauve and blue you can get the matching head wrap uh, to coordinate with the scrunchies and then they had these two-piece barrettes that look like strawberries those are snap clips they also had cherries and you could get a scrunchie to match. This is the one with the strawberries on it. And this one has strawberries. And then there was one that was blue with cherries on it. I think I accidentally took a picture of the same one twice. Over in the pharmacy personal care items, they had the facial oils. And it's like the facial spa kit, like an oil uh, rose extract. And it's got the um, kind of like jade heart shaped thing to rub on your face can't remember what that's called then a bunch of their wedding eye masks they had the bridesmaid maid of honor one that says wifey and one that says mrs also their bath soap pouches these are really nice they don't get these in all the time they did have quite a few of these in this week you put a bar of soap down inside of it and then you can use it as a loofah with the soap connected you know to it some new loofahs and then over in home decor this week they had some really pretty new signs with these crosses and it's got um like a clear plastic glass in it so that you could you know see through the open portions of the crosses and each one has a different saying on it and a different pattern of like flowers butterflies and things like that and the frames around the outside are also different colors then they had these home and love signs with the flowers the home was gray the love was white and the flowers are two different colors of pink so here's how thick it is it's a side view and here's what they look like from the back and here's a better view of them from the front. Some new vases this week. These are clear vases with a holographic kind of iridescent look. They've got three patterns that you could get. One has the little like dots on the outside. One has kind of like a mermaid style or a seahorse style kind of pattern to it. And then the other one just has stripes. They're really pretty. A bunch of these Serenity candles in the short living section and then also some of their new um these are like the canvas uh kitchen magnets that you could purchase now for housewares home maintenance 
electronics and storage this week. They had these cart eraser sponges. You get two for a dollar twenty-five, and they're uh, double-sided. Also, they had these large bins. You could get them in dark blue, teal, orange, and um, kind of like a magenta or bright pink. You could also get the hot pad holders in the same colors and the plastic bins. They only had those in the pink and the two colors of blue. They didn't have that red orange color in the bins. Just the three colors, the two blue and the pink. I also found some new, um, these are night lights that glow. So one glows um, red, pink, and then they have blue. Over in Kitchen and Pantry this week, they had some new little drink packs. These are the four pack of Happy Drinks in the Blue Raspberry. Some um, Nature Goddess fruit drinks like pomegranate or the five count pack of the Grape Kool-Aid mix. Some new bowls in red. The place mats to coordinate with the um, kitchen set here that says like live every moment, laugh every day. They have the plates to match, the towels, coffee cups, the salad bowls, and saucers. Also some food tents out for, um, you know, picnics outside. They have those in the red, white, and blue. And a few of the stores had them in the bright pink, teal, and uh, dark blue. They also have their lemon Dish sets out with the oven mitts, hot pad holders, water glasses, the small plates, large plates. These are all repeats from the last few years. They did put these back out this year. I wasn't sure if they were going to when they put out the bumblebee set, but they did get these in this week or they started to. Then they had their mason jar cups with the buffalo plaid lids and straws. And you could find those in the blue and the white. Also there, um, Ice cube trays, those have the rubber bottoms on them, so you can push the um, ice cubes out. Those, again, are in the um, red, orange, the dark blue, the teal, and the pink to match the bins and things they have out for summertime. Over in the home office, home library, and teaching tree section, they had these new sticker books. That's Paw Patrol. There's 50 pages with activities and stickers. And then they had these large book bins with the purple flowers. You could also get this one here with the green and blue plaid, the ombre pink flowers, and then the black and white buffalo plaid. And those are the cardboard boxes you can pop up and store books in. They had their mini writing tablets and some new colors this week. They had peach, lavender, bright pink and bright blue, and a few new small journal notebooks. This one says the future is bright. This one here with the sunshine on it, it says be the sunshine. And then stuff I can't say out loud. That always makes me laugh when they put those funny sayings on the cover. They had some large erasers that have that ombre look to them that say like delete and oops on the front. And then the large marble trays for the desk organizers, those are back in this week. For the party supplies this week, they had a bunch of pride items like the rainbow sunglasses. You can get them in like the regular sunglass style. They also had hearts and circular sunglasses. Then they had some party supplies like the plates that were rainbow. They had different banners. Um, there were... I believe that they were over by the Juneteenth items that I showed you guys last week, and they were up in the front by the luau items. They had some banners for the door. Large banners you could hang on the wall. Then some of their um, beaded necklaces with rainbows and hearts at the bottom. Those are just plastic. And then some more of the tissue fan garland banners. They also had mini um, metal pails with the rainbow. This one has the rainbows with some white background. They also had one that said love that was spelled out in rainbow. Or you could get one that says pride all over in the rainbow colors. Then they had some more of the bridal party items like advice and wishes for the bride. You get 16 in the pack. They have the pink background with the rose gold accent on the front. I think for $1.25, that's a really good price, especially to use for a bridal shower. They had a bunch of um, the sashes, like for bachelor parties or bride-to-be, and a bunch of different colors. And then a 
a whole bunch of these gift boxes with the bows already attached. Those are some of my favorites that they get in each year. Then for the pet supplies, they had the cat toys in. You can actually cut these to like a window or a wall so the balls don't come out and they can track the balls. And you can attach a few of these together, I think. I'm not 100% sure, but they do have those in a few different colors. You can get them in the pink or the soft blue. And then they have the travel water bowls in pink, dark blue, red, and gray. And those just pop up or lay flat for storage. And there's a carabiner on the side so you can carry it on like a bag or just put it up in your car somewhere to take with you. For the seasonal items this week, they had um, the flamingos for the yard. There was a bunch of those. And then they also had some new party platters and plates with like the two cans and palm leaves. So you can get the um, platter that kind of looks like a surfboard, the large platter, a large serving plate. They had small serving bowls and then the large serving bowl. And these are all like that melamine style plastic. So they had the two cans, then you can get the citrus fruits. It's like, um, ne looks like nectarines or peaches and lemons. I'm not sure if they're oranges or like a peach or a nectarine, but they have just the citrus fruits there. It's really pretty. And then they have the pineapples with the flowers. And then the last one that they have has all the different like watermelon on the front. I think the watermelon were probably my top pick. I, the second one I liked the most was definitely the citrus with the lemon. The watermelon was just fine because it was a little bit different than what they usually carry. They had their tablecloths to match. And then some red and blue steak lights for the yard. And now for toys, games, and entertainment. This week, they had these color forms, sticker stories. They had like Arthur. It comes with like 40 stickers. There's three different scenes that you can decorate with the reusable stickers. So they're kind of bringing back a lot of these older cartoons. I know my son's going to be 27. And I remember him watching that cartoon when he was little. They also have um, like dinosaur trains, um, the Bernstein Bears, they had the Eleanor Wonders Why, and then a bunch of these rubber duckies for the um, bathtub. They had the fireman, the policeman, and the nurse. Uno to go, the mini cards. Also some outdoor fun bubble um, play set. has a bunch of different bubble wands. Then they also had the two pack of the extra large bubble wands. And then these large bubble fans that you do need to put batteries in. They had the cup gun shooters. Usually they just have the caps without the guns. And then they do have these DIY wacky tracks, which are very popular right now. And for the Dollar Tree Plus items, which are the 3 to $5 items, they had these large animals that are similar to like a squish and mold. They're very soft. They are $5 each. They had a dinosaur and a, I think this is a bunny. They also had these four pack of um, collectible tins. It has a charm, a clip, a magnet, cards, and a sticker sheet that you collect in each one. And they are $5 each. There's four different uh, ones that you can buy in this set. Then they had the Marvel $5 uh, plastic figurines. And these are the plastic free packaging. Also the Love Diana pocket watch. Um, these are kind of like a knockoff Legos. They had these little miniature Lego sets. They had like a swimming pool, um, a, like a dance studio. So a couple different, um, like faux Lego brick miniature sets. I had a bedroom set. It was like a slumber party. I think there were four that they had in all. Also this 10 pack of socks you get for $3. They're hundred percent polyester. And that's it for today's video. A little bit shorter this week. They still didn't have everything stocked out on the shelves. Again, we do DIY videos every Thursday with the wedding. We haven't posted a DIY video the last two weeks, but I'm hoping to get the video I made this week edited and out for next week. But we do um, 
the DIY videos and of course the Dollar Tree videos every single Friday. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. I'd really appreciate it. And I hope you all have a lovely weekend. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.